which medications and treatments can cause weight gain. Eat less and move more to lose weight. Well, it's not rocket science. Everyone knows that. But if it's that simple, why can't people lose weight? And why are there so many diets? Some people are successful in the short term, but regain weight and sometimes regain more than they have lost. Unless you know the reason for weight gain, how can you lose weight? Our team of experts has compiled 24 medications or treatments that could cause weight gain. This may not cover every cause, but we have tried our best to provide a brief explanation of each one. For more details, please register free at simplyweight.co.uk. Watch all the videos and find out what all the causes for weight gain are and which are affecting you. Once you know this, you might be able to sort them out. Steroids like prednisolone and hydrocortisone. Many people with lupus take prednisolone, whilst people with skin problems such as eczema and psoriasis use topical hydrocortisone to reduce swelling and itching. Prednisolone not only causes weight gain, but also leads to a redistribution of fat to the face, neck and abdomen. Hydrocortisone causes sodium retention, which can also cause fluid retention and increased blood pressure. Tricyclic antidepressants. These act by increasing the levels of serotonin in the blood and cells, which is known to have a calming effect and to induce sleep. An estimated 50% of all patients who stop using these types of antidepressants do so because they cannot cope with the weight gain. The antidepressant effects of the drugs are often outweighed by the depression caused by poor body image. Paroxetine antidepressant. This is an SSRI or selective serotonin reuptake inhibitor, which effectively increases the amount of available serotonin in the blood. Effects can be increased calcium and cholesterol levels and either weight gain or weight loss due to a decreased or increased appetite, depending on individual circumstances. Fluoxetine or Prozac, another antidepressant which is often prescribed for bulimia and binge eating as well as depression. It's another SSRI which can cause short term weight loss, but which seems to cause weight gain over time due to improved appetite during recovery. Mirtazapine or Remeron, another type of antidepressant known as NASA drugs, which is used to treat a wide range of anxiety disorders. Theories about why it causes weight gain include increasing fat stores throughout the body, decreasing metabolism, altering leptin levels, increases in fatigue, meaning less activity, and food cravings. Monoamine oxidase inhibitors, or MAOIs. These antidepressants work by effectively increasing the amounts of neurotransmitters and other chemicals in the brain. People taking these antidepressants need to be particularly careful about ingesting certain foods and other medications. Side effects of the drugs include dizziness on standing, sleep disturbance at night, sleepiness during the day, meaning care is needed when driving, dry mouth, tremors, difficulty passing urine, especially in men, weight loss or weight gain. The impact on the patient's sleep patterns seems to be the main reason for weight gain. Antipsychotics. These were originally developed for the treatment of schizophrenia and bipolar disorder, but can also be prescribed to treat depression by changing the activity of neurotransmitters in the brain. Side effects include drowsiness, dizziness, lightheadedness, stomach upset, dry mouth, constipation and increased appetites leading to weight gain. Alongside the increase in appetite, they are thought to slow metabolism, increase fat storage, thirst and even increased incidence of sugar cravings. Chlorpromazine, another antipsychotic which blocks receptors, particularly those linked to dopamine. This drug can cause drowsiness, dizziness due to low blood pressure, skin sensitivity especially to sunlight, dry mouth, abnormal movements in the face and tongue and weight gain. It is thought to reduce interest in being active and to slow the metabolism. Anticonvulsants like gabapentin used to treat epilepsy and peripheral nerve pain by stabilizing electrical activity in the brain. Common side effects include drowsiness, 
loss of appetite or increasing appetite, problems with digestion such as diarrhea or constipation and can sometimes cause problems with memory. Different patients seem to experience different symptoms. Weight gain seems most likely when gabapentin is taken in high doses of around 3000 mg per day. Carbamazepine, another anticonvulsant which is also used to treat epilepsy by decreasing electrical activity and can be used as a mode stabiliser in bipolar disorder. Side effects include dizziness, drowsiness, nausea and vomiting, dry mouth, loss of balance and coordination. Weight gain appears to be a typical side effect of taking carbamazepine, but no reasons appear to be known why this should happen. Lithium. Lithium is a treatment used as a mood stabiliser for people with bipolar disorder. It is not clear why people gain weight with lithium, but is thought to impact on the hormones the body uses to store fat and control blood sugar. Pizotifen. Pizotifen is an antihistamine used as a preventative to reduce the frequency of migraines and severe disabling headaches. Pizotifen is thought to work by blocking serotonin, which will lead to weight gain through slowing the metabolism and increasing hunger. Antihistamines. These are drugs that can be prescribed or bought off the shelf to counter the effects of allergies. Those who take antihistamines were 55% more likely to be overweight than their non-allergy suffering peers, with men more likely to gain weight than women. Fexofenadine Antihistamines which can counter the effects of allergies such as sneezing and itchy skin. A 2010 study found that people taking prescription antihistamines such as Allegra and Zyrtec were 55% more likely to be overweight than those not taking the drugs. Oral contraceptive pills. Weight gain from taking oral contraceptives is thought to be more likely caused by fluid retention rather than an increase in fat. Injectable depot metrooxyprogesterone acetate DMPA has been closely linked with weight gain. Tamoxifen breast cancer medication. There seem to be different camps regarding whether tamoxifen causes weight gain. Many doctors claim that the weight gain is just as likely to have been caused by chemotherapy rather than the drug. Sodium valproate. These can be used as gastro-resistant tablets but as alim chrono it is prescribed for people with epilepsy. It is known to cause excessive weight gain and insulin resistance. Carbimazole. People with an overactive thyroid are prescribed carbimazole, so it is bound to cause weight gain as it slows down thyroid activity. The thyroid controls how well calories are burnt, so slowing this activity reduces this. Insulin. Insulin helps to control blood sugar levels and can be prescribed for people with type 2 diabetes. Ironically, one study found that people gained nearly 5 kilograms on average during their first three years of taking insulin, so the treatment could lead to more obesity. Sulfonyl ureas. These are drugs prescribed to manage diabetes. Even though they improve glucose uptake, they do not make your body as effective as it could be because of insulin resistance. This results in excess glucose being stored as fat. Thiazolid inediones. Of all the diabetes treatments, some of the worst offenders for weight gain are Actos and Avandia. Even with treatment, there is not a 100% improvement in glucose use because of insulin resistance, so this excess is stored as fat. Beta blockers. Atenolol or Tenormin, Lepressa or Metoprolol, and Indoral or Proponolol. These are generally older beta blockers prescribed for high blood pressure, glaucoma and anxiety and are generally thought to slow the metabolism. More often than not, these are only prescribed if more recent medications haven't been effective. AIDS. People who are taking HIV medicines and living longer sometimes experience visible changes in body shape and appearance. This condition is called lipodystrophy 
and results in increased visceral fat and fat in the neck, shoulders, breasts and face. Radiotherapy for a brain tumour. Cancer treatment can affect your appetite, eating habits and weight. And although many treatments can cause weight loss, it has been found that radiotherapy for brain tumours seems likely to cause weight gain. Thank you for watching. If you feel you have not identified a cause, watch our other videos on similar topics. If, if you do feel you have a condition, do consult your doctor. There is always a reason for weight gain. To lose weight and keep it off, you need to know the underlying cause. To find out more, please register free at simplyweight.co.uk. Please like, subscribe and comment.